viewers, we're back with another episode of Caesar 4 today. As you can see, I guess the last time I saved, we were in the Patrician Plaza. I was trying to figure out how to upgrade my security force, and I don't understand that. If you guys find out, please comment. Today I'm going to work on that in particular, because that's the only thing I need left for this city in particular. Um, I don't know. I think it's rising, but I'm not sure. Yeah. It's rising. I have everything controlled. Everything's under cover. You know, it's 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 great. Everything's covered except for that one um area of the city security. I'm guessing it was just like a glitch or something because I'm pretty sure we have enough security on the streets already as it is. Prefects and engineers everywhere. Huh. Well, uh, let's check it out. Well, I guess the area needs more beautification, to be honest. While we're waiting for that to go up. And I could move a couple more people into the district. Uh, I could also fix up these streets. I mean, like, these are some beautiful streets and all, but... Like, they're so un... Uh... Efficient. So how... How many people live in here? Alright, <clears throat> anyway, I'm gonna spend the day beautifying basically the city until we finish this mission and I can move on to the next one. Let's see what I can do here. I'm gonna work on this quarter first though. Get some trees and stuff in here. Some more roads, infrastructure is always good. Empires always need infrastructure. Oh. Some flowers. All that good stuff in here. to enter and exit the district whenever they want due to uh, Roman concrete roads everywhere. Alright. So I was thinking like the next time I play the game I'll make the roads bigger just to make it more interesting. Um, if I have the cash at least. As you can see like we didn't start having all of these theaters and Roman life buildings everywhere. Oh man. Oh, okay. The entertainment's uh, rising in the city. We should probably give some more hygiene to prevent plagues. I've already got enough of these stupid trees everywhere. <clears throat> so that needs to go. Like ASAP. Enough of that. Alright. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. What in the world? It's gross. Rocks. Ship it. Just so many uh, conflicts in this town that have happened. I feel like the people are disturbed. Just they they feel better now. It's like bathhouses and stuff everywhere. But the beginning of this world was not an easy one. I'll tell you that right now. Food stocks are always low. City is not easy to live in. This one in particular. Somewhere in the Balkans area. Alright. A couple beautification. 
foundation pieces over here. Giant statue for no reason. Check the security. Yep, oh, yep. Security's rising. It was obviously a problem. So much productivity, it's ridiculous. I have like everything Rome needs. <laughs> I don't need to bother with them anymore. They they made me angry. I used to be that kind of governor, you know. I've come through so much. City on fire, people on fire, Gauls destroying us, earthquakes hitting, the gods being mad, shooting lightning bolts at the out of the sky. We've made it. We've we've come far. Now the barbarians won't even look in our direction due to having horsemen and stuff just patrolling the streets constantly. Savages. We stay we kept the savages. Yes. Hmm. Well guys, well this was a short episode. Um I will I'll pause here and start a new one so we can start the new city. This will be excellent. As you can see my governing skills got me through this terrible time. Um somehow I made it in this flea infested rat bag land <laughs> but yeah i will catch you guys on the next episode if you're still watching see you later